Rogers. I'm studying communication here at the University of Western Australia. Audience design is when you uh, think about the perspective of your audience or the person who you're talking with and then you design your communication accordingly from your audience's perspective. For example, um, you know, uh, everybody's had the uh, experience of being asked their opinion from someone else and uh, when you're uh, answering that opinion you're likely to perhaps be thinking about your audience's perspective before you provide your opinion. Hey Shane. Oh, hey Louise, how are you going? I'm good, how are you? Oh, not too bad. Uh, what, what have you been up to? I just got back from shopping actually. How about this? Do you like it? Oh, what's with those colours? How could you have bought that? Oh, it, yeah, it's lovely. It uh, really brings out the colour in your eyes. Thanks. Okay, so that was a kind of classic example of a situation where you are aware of what your audience's perspective is and then uh, you design what you say um, with your audience's perspective in mind. Yeah. But uh, there are other situations where you don't necessarily know what your audience's perspective is, for example, when you're speaking with a stranger. Oh, hey, excuse me. Do you happen to know where the psychology department is? Oh, I think that's an American accent. You're obviously not from here. I'd better keep it general. Uh, yeah, yeah, sure. Um, if you head kind of over this direction, yeah. um, there's some trees, you go through them, uh, and then uh, on your right, you'll come across a big grey building, uh -huh. and then... Ah, uh... oh, you're from UWA. Uh, you'll probably know where the guild is then. Oh, uh, you know the guild coffee shop? Yes. Yeah? Oh, well, it's just next to that. So if you head to the guild coffee shop, you can't miss it. Oh, okay, cool. I know exactly where that is. Thanks. Yeah. See ya. And so... I change my communication to suit my changed perspective about what the knowledge is on the campus and so I make a much more, I use more specific terms such as, oh it's next to the Guild Coffee Shop, whereas I wouldn't have said that earlier. When communicating with other people, one thing to especially be aware of is that your own perspective, whilst clear to you, isn't necessarily going to be clear for someone else. And so it's a good idea to really consider the perspective of your audience when you're communicating to them and design your messages accordingly and that way you should avoid many misunderstandings.